Hello and welcome back. In this video, I will show you how you can adjust the speed of a rotation like this. Let's get started. So here we have a cube. And this cube is using the find look at rotation node to rotate to the character every tick. And here we have the code for it. So what we're going to make today is we're going to have an interpolation node. And you get this node by right clicking and typing R and then interp. The R interp to node. So click on it and you will see this node. Now this node has four input pins and one output. So the first input pin will be the cube's current rotation and the target will be the find look at rotation return value because that is the target rotation we want to interpolate to. Then we have a delta time and this delta time will be connected to the delta seconds of the tick event. Lastly we have the interpolation speed and this will be the speed in which the cube will rotate to its target rotation. So now let's connect all these pins. So first let's drag out of the cube reference and we want to get its rotation. So now we connect this rotation to the current input. Then the target will be the find look at rotation. Delta seconds we connect it to delta time. And for the interpolation speed we can change it to a different value. So if this value is 1 then it will turn very slowly but if it's 20 then it will turn very fast. So we'll set it at about 10. Lastly, you want to connect the return value to the set world rotation node. Now just a quick note, if you want to know what this setup is, then please go to the find look at rotation tutorial. There'll be a link here. Now compile and save, and go back to the map. Now when we play, you'll see there's a slight delay on when the cube will rotate. So we have a, a slight lag. And if we want to reduce this lag, then we can set the interpolation speed to 20. Then when we play, the lag is reduced. But if we want more lag, then we can change it to 5. And when we play, you'll see the lag is much more evident. So this is how you can adjust the speed of a rotation in Unreal Engine. And you do that by using the R interp to node. So I hope this video has helped you. If you have any questions, please comment down below. And thank you to the person who requested this tutorial. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And let's see if we can hit 200 subscribers. See you soon.